हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू सॉल्व दिस नाइस क्यूबिक इक्वेशन फॉर द वैल्यू ऑफ एम सो इफ वी हैव एम क्यूब्ड इक्वल्स टू 27 ओवर 8 सो नाउ वी फाइंड ऑल द थ्री रूट्स ऑफ दिस इक्वेशन ओके सो द वेरी फर्स्ट स्टेप वी आर गोइंग टू डू इज हियर फर्स्ट वी नीड टू फोकस इन द राइट हैंड साइड एंड यू नो दैट वी राइट 27 इक्वल्स टू 3 क्यूब्ड and uh, we write 8 equals to 2 cubed okay so here we need to replace 27 3 cube 8 2 cube so that our above equation uh, is implies that uh, m cubed equals to we write 27 as 3 cubed we write 8 as 2 cubed and after this step here we need to uh, combine these two exponents according to this law if we have a to the power of m divided by b to the power of m it is equals to a over b and its exponent is m okay so according to this uh, we can combine the exponent of these two terms and it will be written as m cubed equals to 3 over 2 cubed okay so further uh, we need to move this m uh, this 3 over 2 cubed in the left hand side and it will be written as uh, m cubed minus 3 over 2 cubed and this is equals to 0 so here further we need to apply the uh, nice cubic formula you know that if we have a cubed minus b cubed it is equals to a minus b times of a square plus a b plus b square so according to this cubic formula we write our above cubic equation as in this form so here you have our a is m and our b is 3 over 2 so according to this formula we write our above uh, equation as a minus b so here our a is m minus b is 3 over 2 into this is a square so here our a is m square plus a b so again a is m and b is 3 over 2 plus b square so b is also 3 over 2 square and this whole equals to 0. So here further we need more simplifications and uh, we uh, again rewrite this expression as in this form m minus 3 over 2 times of uh, m square plus this will be written as uh, 3 over 2 into m plus this is 3 squared and 3 squared equals to 9 and 2 squared equals to 4 and this whole equals to 0. So further we need uh, more simplification and now we convert this equation into the two cases so that our first case is to take m minus 3 over 2 equals to 0 and the second case is m square plus 3 over 2 m plus 9 over 4 equals to 0. So now uh, uh, in order to find uh, the as solutions of the equation first we focus on this case and here we need to move this minus 3 over 2 to the right hand side and it will becomes m equals to 3 over 2 so this is the over uh, first solution of the given equation and now in order to find the other solutions we need to focus on this quadratic equation so uh, according in order to solve this quadratic equation first we write this into the standard form for so that now here we need to multiply uh, on both of the sides by 4 in order to remove these fractions fractional coefficients okay in order to remove these fractional coefficients we can just multiply both sides by 4 when you multiply both sides by 4 it will be written as 4m square plus uh, here you multiply 4 by 3 over 2m plus 4 multiplied by 9 over 4 and this is equals to 0 and further uh, we have 4 m square plus this is 2 times of 2 is 4 and 2 times of 3 is 6 m plus this 4 is cancelled out by this 4 and plus 9 equals to 0 and now in the next step here uh, we need to use a quadratic formula in order to solve this quadratic equation 
So in order to use the quadratic formula, first we need to write the coefficients of this equation and its coefficients are a equals to 4, b equals to 6 and c is equals to 9. Uh, these are the coefficients of the above equation and now we state the quadratic formula as here m is equals to minus b plus minus square root of b square minus 4 times of ac divided by 2 times of a this is the our quadratic formula and now we substitute the values of a b and c here and it will be written as m equals minus b the value of b is 6 plus minus square root of b square b is 6 square minus 4 times of a is 4 and c is 9 and it is divided by 2 times of a so here our a is also 4 okay so here we need more simplifications and uh, now uh, we uh, write this expression as minus 6 plus minus square root of 6 square equals to 36 minus here we need to multiply uh, 4 multiplied by 4 multiplied by 9 so the output of this multiplication equals to 144 and it is divided by 2 times of 4 equals to 8 okay so here we need to uh, 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 subtract 36 minus uh, 134 but here uh, first we write this as minus 6 plus minus so uh, 36 minus 144 equals to minus 108 and it is divided by 8 so now here we need to focus on this radical term so here uh, we first separate this square root on both of these terms and it will be written as minus 6 plus minus square root of 108 into square root of minus 1 divided by 8 so uh, after this we have minus 6 plus minus we write uh, this 108 as 36 multiplied by 3 we know that 36 times 3 becomes 108 and we also know that the square root of minus 1 equals to iota and it is divided by 8 this is the value of m so further uh, we have m is equals to minus 6 plus minus we know that a square root of 36 uh, is equals to 6 into square root of 3 and it is divided by 8 into iota we write this iota on just this term only okay so here we need more simplifications and now here we need to take common uh, 6 or we just break this fraction and we write it as m equals to minus 6 over 8 plus minus 6 into square root of 3 iota over 8 so we cancel this term so you have 2 3 is a 6 2 4 is a 8 2 3 is a 6 and 2 4 is a 8 so finally we have the remaining two roots of the given equation are minus 3 over 4 plus minus 3 into square root of 3 iota and it is divided by 4 these are the other two complex roots of the given equation and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos